With this holidays upon us, we thought it'd be nice to whip up something special for you guys. For the entire week, we're going to be allowing you guys to gift your friends subscriptions and pro guides coaching sessions. Also, check out our brand new Clicks course where he teaches you all the ins and outs of going pro. Grab this opportunity while it lasts. Click the top right or down below to get started. Bunch of Crunch Army, woo! Where you at, your motivation guy is back. All right, we gotta hop into our brand new Fortnite series today. Fortnite versus. So, in this series, we're gonna be taking two Fortnite players, content creators, or organizations, and place them against each other by evaluating them in four essential categories until we declare a winner. So, in this case, we're going to compare two content creators. So our categories today, we're gonna be basing it off of creativity, humor, production quality, and last but certainly not least, in-game skill. So, who do you think is gonna come out victorious? Laser Beam or Lachlan? Let me know in the comments below. I'm curious to hear what you guys think. Punch your crunch on me. You guys ready for this? Let's get this going. All right, guys, so the first way that we're gonna be comparing these two content creators is by how creative they are. Like this category is gonna consist of a variety of things, all right? Everything from content ideas to production quality. All right, with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, bunch of crunch on me, let's take a first look at Laser Beam. Here we go. So at this point in time, Laser Beam has 17.5 million subscribers. Like, bro, let me just borrow like 2 million, all right? And he's recently been creating content in two main games, Fortnite and Among Us, all right? So based on this channel, it appears that he's posting both games like fairly equally. Mixing in random other content such as TikTok reactions and also Minecraft. And so for the sake of judging creativity solely based on Fortnite content, we gotta take a look at Laser Beam's recent videos and judge their creativity level. Here we go. Laser Beam posts a variety of Fortnite content with some of his recent videos being I Won in Sand, The Galactus Event, and Teaching My Dad How to Play Fortnite. He's also posted a variety of meme-based Fortnite content, which is a pretty interesting niche in Fortnite that Laser Beam occupies. Overall, I'm gonna give Laser Beam an eight out of 10 on creativity for a couple of reasons. All right, first up, teaching my dad Fortnite video is very unique. I don't know about you guys, but I haven't seen anything similar to this on YouTube before. He also has videos such as whatever you build, I will buy. That has never been seen before on YouTube and are extremely creative. The reason Laser Beam is only getting an 8 out of 10 is because despite his extremely unique videos, he also posts videos like the Galactus event and winning games with no guns type of videos, both of which have been posted on YouTube by many other creators. All right, now for Lachlan. Okay, all of the Laser Beam videos at the surface seem to be, you know, significantly more creative than Lachlan's, but Lachlan is definitely unique in his own way. Okay, so unlike Laser Beam, Lachlan only posts Fortnite content to his 14.4 million subscribers at the time in this video. He mainly focuses on taking one specific aspect of Fortnite in each video. For example, when the new Halo skin came out, he made a video wearing a skin, <laughs> talking about it and winning a game with the skin on. Similarly, he posted a video about the exotic snowball launcher where he goes and he gets the launcher and he shows it in use. Nothing about Lachlan's content is extremely creative, but he does occupy his own niche of a type of video like this. For this reason, we're going to give him a four out of 10 for creativity. All right, so moving on to the next category, we got humor. All right, first, let's take a look at Laser Beam. Anybody who watches Laser Beam's Fortnite videos must agree that they are incredibly entertaining. For example, I won in Sand video where he spends the entire match hiding from his clueless appointments and sometimes even jumps out of the sand to kill them after baiting them with loot. My goodness. Not to mention, he has an entire series solely dedicated to Fortnite memes. In that series, him and his friends produce extremely funny content by hopping into the lobby and just messing with people. I don't know about you guys, but it seems that Laser Beam's success is all really reliant on his humor within the videos, and really it definitely shows. For this reason, we're gonna give my man a nine out of 10 for humor. All right, Lachlan on the other hand seems to post content that is more informative and engaging where humor is almost implemented accidentally. Like he plays normal games showing off different items and every once in a while a humorous moment might transpire. This is a lot different from Laser Beam's content, which, you know, in a lot of cases is meant to be funny from the beginning. So Lachlan also doesn't have any series like Laser Beam's dedicated solely to just having fun and trolling the games. For these reasons, 
We're gonna give Lachlan a four out of 10 for humor. All right, guys, at this point, it might seem like a blow off for laser beam, but you better not go anywhere just yet because production quality definitely might sway the odds in Lachlan's favor. All right, so when we look at laser beam's production quality, I love this guy, but we gotta be really real. We gotta be really real because we're comparing these two giants, all right? For his production quality, it's really just nothing that special. Like his titles aren't really that clean. He doesn't really use proper grammar and overall his channel is kind of basic, right? Like although his videos are 60 FPS and 1080p, it's relatively standard for somebody of his caliber of content creator. And what's kind of disappointing in his overall lack of effort and visuals and aesthetics and videos, right? Like when we open up Laserbeam's YouTube channel, we see a zoomed in picture of his face for his avatar. You know, this looks really meme-y, which is, you know, which is really what a lot of his content really is. And overall, doesn't really seem that high of a quality. Not to mention his header is just his creator code in white and black and in Comic Sans font. It even looks like he made it in paint. When we look at the titles of his videos, he rarely uses proper grammar, you know, just leaving letters in lowercase form form and really not coming up with creative titles whatsoever. Finally, when we click on one of his videos, his webcam has no overlay, the lighting behind him, it's kind of boring and blank. Overall, this production quality is just kind of subpar for considering his size and status. Obviously, he has a dope quality camera and microphone as you would expect from a YouTuber with like 17.5 million subscribers, but that still doesn't make up for the overall lack of quality. So for these reasons, I'm gonna have to give my guy a four out of 10 for production quality. All right, now this category, on the other hand, is where Lachlan flourishes. So when we go to Lachlan's channel, he has a very clean profile picture as well as an aesthetically pleasing header. His header has his name, you know, some animated Fortnite characters and his code. All of the titles of his videos are creative. You know, they use proper grammar and are overall just very specific, right? Similar to Laserbeam, Lachlan also has a very high quality camera and microphone, but unlike Laserbeam, he includes a very unique overlay with the green screen behind him, which, you know, exponentially grows the quality of each video. Both creators have a very similar editing style when it comes to production, so we're not gonna like take that into account. For these reasons, we're gonna give Lachlan my guy, a 10 out of 10 for production quality. All right, so it's an extremely close race thus far. All right, we're gonna go into the last round and we're gonna be comparing their in-game skill levels, guys. Here we go. So when comparing these two creators in terms of in-game skill, it's sort of challenging, to be real. Like, as a result of Laserbeam posting, you know, mainly funny, meme content, it's just kind of somewhat challenging to just gauge his true skill level. The majority of his videos is him trolling his opponents and just having fun with his friends. Laserbeam shows exceptional aim and, you know, fairly decent mechanics for a content creator. And on top of all of this, in almost all of his meme videos, he wins a lot of his games alongside racking up a fair amount of kills in those games as well. He doesn't play post arena content and it seems to be a slightly above average public match player. For these reasons guys, we're gonna give him a five out of 10 for in-game skills. On the other side of things, we got Lachlan. All right, Lachlan posts a lot more gameplay related content, which means that, you know, it's a lot easier for us to kind of gauge his skill level. Although he generally plays public matches and not arena, it's still fairly easy for us to really get a good sense of his overall skill level. And so in a lot of Lachlan's videos, he's seen hot drop in and just, you know, racking up a lot of kills. Not to mention his overall building and fighting techniques are very fundamentally Sound. Due to us being able to get a better sense of his skill level, it's just so much easier for us to give him a proper rating than it was for Laser Beam. And so, also for him, you know, displaying very above average Fortnite skills, but having very little to no arena content, we're gonna give Lachlan over here a seven out of 10 for in game skill. All right, guys, so where does that leave us? We gotta tally these points and do a quick recap. Now for the results. All right. In the creativity category, Laser Beam scored an eight out of 10 due to videos like Whatever You Build and I Will Buy. Unfortunately, Lachlan didn't do well in this category, only scoring a four out of 10 due to his fairly basic videos that focus on one specific item or feature within Fortnite. Next in the humor category, Laser Beam built his lead scoring a nine out of 10 due to his meme Olympic series and overall humorous based style. 
Lachlan, on the other hand, once again, really didn't do so hot right here. With Lachlan's content being more gameplay based than humor based, he only managed to pull a four out of 10 in this category. All right, so things turned around for Lachlan though in the production category when his titles, webcam design, and overall video aesthetic blew us away, earning himself a 10 out of 10 for production quality. And this was not the case for Laser Beam though. Laser Beam's lack of proper aesthetic and what appears to be like kind of little effort in the production quality you know, only landing him a four out of 10 in this category. All right, it all came down to the final category with Laser Beam holding on to just a three point lead going into the final category. In game skill, due to Lachlan having more gameplay based content, it was just fairly easy for us to gauge his overall skill level. And with him consistently winning games with a fair amount of kills on top of solid aim and mechanics, Lachlan earned a seven out of 10 for in game skill. So this wound unfortunately was not enough to edge out the victory with Laser Beam, earning a five out of 10 in the in game skill category due to his also, you know, solid mechanics and aim on top of constantly winning games when he puts himself at a clear disadvantage like his I Won in Sand video. All right, guys, this brings us to our final score of 26 out of 40 for Laser Beam and 25 out of 40 for Lachlan, crowning Laser Beam the first ever Pro Guys Fortnite versus Champion. All right, so did this come as a surprise to any of you guys? Let me know. And you know, what were your original predictions? Were they right? And uh, Laser Beam, this is for you. What did you think about this? Yo, you already know, hit your boy up, all right? All right, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Once again, Pro Guys family, bunch of crunch army. Where you at? Your motivation guy is back. Make sure you guys like the video, sub to the channel, because we got a lot more hot stuff coming out very, very soon. I'll see you then.